get downloading the one football app it is free the link is in the description for that all the latest news your transfers your gossip stats with newcastle united every football fan needs it all right guys welcome back to newcastle fans tv i'm here with troops subscribe to his channel the link will be in the description troops very comfortable evening for arsenal today 2-0 do you have to get out of second gear tonight like what the fuck these men are mad blood. The men are driving past <laughs> beeping, screaming, fuck Tottenham blood. I think it was Pochettino, wasn't it, after he's just realised Arsenal have gone above them, aren't they? Bro, these men, like... <laughs> I don't... <coughs> like, nobody really thought, like, we'd get flat in the, into this, like, position, innit? Yeah. Where top four is a fucking big possibility, blood. You understand? But it's our home form, innit? That's got us there, the award. The away form's a bit mad. We need to improve that if we want to stay in this position. But tonight, like... We had a... F I think, like... We were like we we caused our own problems. You understand? Gwendozi was a bit sloppy. Every time he gave it the ball, you lot kinda got in. You get me? I think you lot kinda pinpointed him. You understand? Because every minute he had the ball, there was about three men around him. I think first half the army was just kind of doing his thing. I think until we got the goal, it was kind of an even half. We got the goal, that's when things changed. Do you think Aaron Ramsey should have been given a new contract because he takes his goal well? Yeah. You know, Ramsey's always gonna be one of those players at Arsenal, probably gonna look back in a few years and go, do you know what? He did a job for us, but was he consistent enough? But do you think that Arsenal should have given a new contract, or was he got past that stage almost? Got these two old, maybe? Nah, I would have kept Ramsey. He's a man that I would have kept still, because he can do a job. You understand? These kind of games, he does a job. He'll get the goal. Big games as well, he always turns up, like FA Cup finals and whatnot. He's always one of the players to turn up in a big game. Even away from home, like Ramsey don't shy away. So I'm a bit disappointed that he's gone, but we've lost bigger players, so we just move on from it. But we do need to replace him, you understand? Because you can't lose that calibre of player and then just not replace it. That's where we fucked up in the past. We've got rid of people and not replaced them. I think it's different now, though, isn't it? It's completely different. Emery won't allow that. Emery will make sure something comes in. So, yeah, man, we're looking all right still, I'm not going to lie. I said this to Ch ask Cheeky Sport Joe all this. Yeah. If Emery finishes third with Arsenal, yeah. considering where Arsenal were last season, and Liverpool don't win the title, say Man City win the title, yeah. do you think Emery deserves manager of the year? He should get it anyway, if, even if Liverpool do win it. Because Liverpool have a squad that's capable of winning the title. We don't really have a squad capable of getting the top four. If you look at the teams that are competing for that, we are the weakest team. You understand? And we, Can you honestly say that? Because you look at the likes of maybe Chelsea haven't played as well this yeah, season. No, nah, nah, but if you look at it on paper, our attack is that it. Our attack's the only thing that's really threatening. That's, that's only scaring people. The midfield ain't scaring you. The defence is lightweight. The keeper's solid. Leno's solid. You understand? Very happy with him. But if you look at Chelsea, you understand? They got Cartney in the middle. They got Hazard up front. They got Rudiger in defence. They got Kepper at goal. You understand? United, same thing. They got like Lukaku up top, even though he's a donkey. <laughs> they got Pogba there, you understand? They got like Bay in the, in the defence, they got the Hayer in goal. Tottenham, even though they're scumbags, they got like Kane, Eriksen, like Vertonghen, Lloris, even though he's got a mistake. He's got a Should have saved that the other day, shouldn't Yeah, he? he's got a mistake in him. That's one thing I will say about Lloris. But when you look at like what they have, even the squad, like strength, our, our squad is kind of weak, fam. You understand? Compared to them. That's why we need major investment in summer because we can't be going into the Champions League with this squad. And we'll get battered, fam. Going back into the game tonight, like I said, takes his goal extremely well. Do you think that was the difference almost in the second half? You just when you had to step it up a little bit, and yeah, I thought I, I thought it was a really good goal. Like I've not seen it back, but it just seemed to be mad. so seemed to be so easy for Arsenal. Yeah, it was mad fun. I'm not gonna. I was behind that blood like a blood clot. Z. I was behind that, <laughs> and I stand North Bank. It was a beautiful finish, blood. But he has that in his game. You understand? He has that in his game. People need to people need to put respect on his name as well, blood. People don't really give Laka and Abba the ratings they deserve. Even Emery as well, you understand? I think for me personally, I think it's a hating thing. Yeah. You understand? Man, man, I don't give a fuck, man can hate, innit? We're just doing our thing, innit? You understand? We're, we're going along quietly. We're doing our thing. We're in the quarterfinal of the Europa League, doing what we need to do. We're in third place in the league now. We've all played, this, we've all played the same amount of games. No one, can, no one can tell me shit. I deserve to be third. You understand? The only team to beat me here is Man City in the league. Everyone else has come here, you, you ain't done shit. You understand? We've gone like Tottenham, Tottenham run out their mouth. They've only took they 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 took, they took one point off us this year. We take four of them. You understand? Have, have your little bullshit leak up. What happened next round? You got corned. You understand? Man, I shit, fam. You understand? Like me, we're good. You get me? We're doing what we need to do. We will get top four. You understand? I still think we'll get third. I've been saying it from time, blood. I think that's where you finish the season. Yeah, I think we'll finish third, blood. I think the away the away, the away form's going to improve. Just touching finally on Newcastle. Yeah. Newcastle currently on 35 points. Yeah, you look cool. Do you think that 
what do you think Newcastle need to stay up? Do you, or do you think we're already nah, safe? You're alright, man. You look alright, fam. You understand? I even said to like Renty earlier in the season, you lot don't need to worry. When Rafa gets it rolling, you lot will be good. You got that good signing in as well. We were looking at him. He looks kind of dangerous. You understand? Rondon stepped up. Perez. You got man in there. You get me? Defence is not too bad. You got a good keeper, but he even him, he's got a mistake in him as well. You understand? That Tottenham mistake, bloody, he pissed me off, fam. I don't say about Tottenham, however. Yeah, he pissed me the fuck off, man. <laughs> and I, I nearly punched my screen, fam. You understand? But yeah. I think you lot are cool, man. I think Ashley just needs to fuck off. It's a bit like us with Cronky. Cronky's got to fuck off. And uh, Ashley's got to fuck off. Then I think you lot will be alright. But I think for this season, you're safe, man. See so you at St. James's next season? Yeah, 100%, man. You understand? Good, man. Good, man. I like how I, I, I like night out in Newcastle. <laughs> <laughs> like and subscribe to Newcastle Fans TV, as I've mentioned. Subscribe to Earth Troops channel as well. And we'll see you at the next video. Oh! <laughs>